freezing cold <laughs> and I thought I'd come out here and test between the uh, the DJI 04 Pro which I just picked up recently uh, hacked it into the beta FPV Pavo 20 Pro uh, frame and uh, yeah I've done a quick flight but I thought I'd test it at nighttime to really see how the dynamic range improvement is how the nighttime improvement is I do some pretty uh, tricky stuff nighttime and sometimes indoors so to have a little bit more quality be really good see how that works out against the uh, DJI 03 located in the Proto FPV P3C Cinewhoop frame uh, I just built this frame recently and I really do like the DJI 03 system uh, so excited to actually test this, this out because this will be my first or second time actually flying it with uh, updated rates and filters and stuff like that. Uh, so we'll see how that goes, but yeah, we'll, uh, this is going to be about the 04, the 03, and let's see how it goes. It's getting cold, so let's fly. Okay, we're going to fly the P3C first with the 03, turn down my ISO to 6400, and uh, yeah, I'm flying at 38 FPS. Let's do this. fly so well. I love how this flies. Cold is definitely killing the battery pretty quick. So I'm really happy about that. There's one well, like this cold is pretty early. I can see most stuff, I had a 6400 eye, so let's head over to the dark area just over here. Uh, you can still start to lose detail quite quickly. I mean, it's probably pitch darkness in our regular, using our regular eyes, but you can see it's almost very difficult to see much until you get back into the lighted area to which you can start to see. So this is that 6400 eye, so it's going to limit some of your results for post-processing and stuff. I mean, it's usable. Uh, maybe not for like very high resolution video. I'm just cruising. There we go. Oh, that is not like the cold. It's already 3.51. Let's see if I I don't know. Thank you. Cool. Now we're going to test the 04. Putting on my goggles. Uh, ready to see as so I go through the settings. Same video quality, about 140th of a second, 130th. ISO auto is only at 3000, and I can already see much of the detail, which is great. Already we've got about a stop or so of extra light. Go through some of the different areas again. Alright, hope we're taking off. Oh, look at that detail. Oh, that's nice. Wow, that's great. <laughs> that is detail. I'm seeing this, even though I'm using the Goggles Integra, not the Goggles 3, I'm seeing a ton of detail. I wasn't able to see with the other goggles. And again, my battery's complaining. It is not like it's cold. It's crapping out. I think this, for whatever reason, this drone is a little bit more pushing the whole battery up. Okay, let's go back to the dark area just to see. I can see a whole lot more. I'm seeing some pretty good, a lot more detail uh, in this pretty difficult circumstance. It's great. Oh man, I'm using this for the next one. Yeah, you can see the branches pretty clearly. Nice and bright. the bushes into the dark area. I think we're going over here, right? And just by trees. Yep, we can make out. It's oh, you can see it all. Oh, you can see it all. Now, if we go over here, it starts to crap out a little bit. This is a very difficult area. This is probably pitch black. Compare. We can see all the various detail that we can see. It's established it. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna buy another 04, I think.
I like this a lot. This is incredible. And I'm just going to do a flyby, but yeah, the battery is not liking this at all. I'm getting only about two minutes of flight. I can't push it because it's going to really tank the battery up, so it's tank a little bit. 5 volts, average. I'm not going to do anything crazy here. It's too cold. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, that's fine. Now I'll do a little crotch gap. There we go. That's the 04. That is amazing. 